Are you afraid of God? No. But I'm afraid of you. Are you going to just sit there? As compared to what? Standing? Not standing. Rowing. Rowing? Hadn't planned on it. So you expect me to shoulder What's the this? burden? No. But I do expect you to do all the rowing. And why is that? Coming here was your idea. My idea? I made it very clear that I don't believe in the exercise. The rowing? No. Imagine that's wonderful exercise. Then what? The entire thought experiment. Excuse me. How much longer? One goes into an experiment knowing one could fail. But one does not undertake an experiment knowing one has failed. Can we get back to the rowing? I suggest you do, no, but we're work. never going to get there. No, I mean I'd greatly appreciate it if you would assist. Perhaps you should ask him. I imagine he has a greater interest in getting there than I do. I suppose he does, but there's no point in asking. Why not? Because he doesn't row. He doesn't row? No, he doesn't row. Ah, I see what you mean. arrived. Shall we tell him when we'll be returning? Would that change anything? It might give him some comfort. Well, at least that's something we can agree on. Hey! Somebody meeting me here? I'd certainly hope so. It does seem like a dreadful place to be stranded. Well, maybe there's someone inside. Excuse me, it's Booker DeWitt. I guess you're expecting me? Is anyone here? Hello?
chair. So, uh, what the hell? Make yourself ready, Pilgrim. Attention. The bindings are there as a safeguard. Five thousand feet. Ten thousand feet. Fifteen thousand feet. Excuse me, where am I? Heaven, friend. Or as close as we'll see till Judgment Day. Let's keep such questions to myself, unless I want to get made.
find the exit out of this place. Love the prophet because he loves the sinner. Love the sinner because he is you. Without the sinner, what need is there for a redeemer? Without sin, what grace has forgiveness? On this day of days, we recommit ourselves to our city and to our prophet, Father Costa. We recommit to sacrifice and the giving of thanks and by submerging ourselves in the sweet waters of baptism. And lo, if the prophet has struck down the enemies of wounded me and not railed against the southern beneath us, it would have been enough. If the prophet had just railed against the sovereign beneath us, but not accepted the free golden gifts of the founders, it would have been enough. If the prophet had just accepted the free golden gifts of the founders and not prayed for our deliverance, it would have been enough. If the prophet had only prayed for our deliverance and not led us to this new Eden, it would have been enough. If the prophet had just led us to the new Eden and not purged the vipers of the Orient, it would have been enough if the prophet had just purged the vipers of the Orient, but not suffered the sacrifice of his beloved. Is it someone new? Someone from the southern below, newly come to Columbia to be warded clean before our prophet, our founders, and our Lord? I just need passage into the city. Passage to the city. Brother, the only way to Columbia is through rebirth in the sweet waters of baptism. Will you be cleansed, brother? Let's end with this or turn around and get back on that rocket. Might as well get it over with. Come and... Hey. I baptize you in the name of our prophet, in the name of our founders, and the name of our Lord. I don't know, brothers and sisters, but this one doesn't look clean to me. Who's there? Who's there? Bring us the girl and wipe away the dead! What do you want? We had a deal to it! Open this door right now! I told you! I'm not gonna do it! Go away! Mr. DeWitt! Mr. DeWitt! priest needs to learn the difference between baptizing a man and drowning one. A sword of gold, so that I need to find a landmark and figure out where the hell I am. Above all to Father Franklin, a key of gold so that Eden might have industry that set her above all other nations. To Father Jefferson, a scroll, so that Eden might have laws that set her above all other nations. And so each year we recommit ourselves to our founders. 
and our prophet, Father Comstock. And, and recommit, recommit to, to our, our prophet, prophet Father, Comstock. Father Comstock, so that we may follow in the prophet's path. Amen. Amen. Our prophet fills our lungs with water, so they may better love the air. He who crossed the Delaware with flaming sword and wings of angels, watch over me and lend me strength. Shield my mind from fear and doubt so that I may hold fast against all invaders. Father Washington, hear my prayer. A rebel against ignorance and tyranny. Share with me your wisdom and let the light of your good judgment shine like a beacon through the darkness. Father Jefferson, hear my prayer. By the sword, and the, and the scroll, scroll, and the, and key. the key. Amen. Amen. Luck, only providence, and that you see its divine hand at work, you discern the transmundane. Your inspiration and imagination transcend mere science and open our eyes to the mystery. Father Franklin, hear my prayer. Just because the city flies don't mean it ain't got its fair share of fools. All right, still got a girl to find. I've never Just. had an oyster. I bet we could have something <laughs> Mr. arranged. Mr. you are terrible. Morning. Good to see you. Perfect day for the celebration. Father Comstock must have foreseen and planned it just this way. <gasps> that statue... I just think it fails to capture Father Comstock's absolute... you know, divinity. Like does not matter to a Liberty Scout. There's no room for it. Saltstall's all right, I tell you. Says he's for faith, family, and fatherland. Who could be against all that? my dear fellow, they are a temperamental and unreliable lot to a man. Uh-huh. 
I told him that the park is exceedingly far behind schedule. The, the, the landscaping is half finished. The, the statuary hasn't arrived. The fountain is full of rainwater, for God's sake. Even the marigolds are still unplanted. All work which should have been done months ago. Uh-huh. Do you know what he told me? He said that... Columbia, Raffle, and Fair. Huh. He's strong in the sword, but a bit weak in the key of the scroll, if you get my meaning. Cloud of skies, Honor system, eh? and light variable winds throughout the afternoon. In short, a beautiful day for the festivities, Columbia. And now, back to the music. Submerged. Perhaps that swimmer is both sinner and saint until he is revealed onto the eyes of man. Now do I? Yeah, that's where they said I'd find her. Telegram, Mr. DeWitt. Huh. Telegram for you, sir. DeWitt, stop. Do not alert Comstock to your presence. Stop. Whatever you do, do not pick number 77. Stop. Lutess. Not the... One man goes into the waters of baptism, a different man comes out. Who is that man who lies submerged? Perhaps that swimmer is both sinner and saint Hello? until he is revealed onto the eyes of man. Would you believe me? I if agree. I told you a man could hoist a one-ton stallion straight into the air, would you believe me? Well, friends, I am here today to tell. Those are no flights of fancy. Those are no tall tales told behind the pool hall. No, sir, no, ma'am. Those are vigors I'm talking about. Brought to you courtesy of Mr. Jeremiah Fink himself. Who amongst you has tasted the divine gift of the vigor? One swig and feats of wonderment are at the tips of your fingers. Young sir, you young miss, roll up and try the amazing power of Bucking Bronco. Whether you need it lifted, lofted, tossed, or tumbled, Bucking Bronco is just the ticket. Young sir, young miss, roll up and try the amazing power of Bucking Bronco. Whether you need it lifted, lofted, tossed, or tumbled, Bucking Bronco is just the ticket. 
Voxophones, Voxophones. Hear your voice from the past in the present. Say something, Sonny. What's a Voxophone? What's a Voxophone? Exactly that. A personal record of voice. Hey, just so we're clear, I'm not paying for this. Just a demonstration, sir. Have you sampled any of the new vigors here today? I usually wait till Fink works out the kinks with them. It's safer that way. The Vox Populi are on the loose. Two will hunt them down. Hey, you! Handy with a rifle? Looking to do your part for Columbia? Show your skill by hunting down Daisy Fitzroy and the vile members of the Vox Populi. Shoot the targets. Turn the boys up. It's in the prize. Wonder of the world. He's big. He's bold. He's the amazing handyman. Only in our fair city will you see such amazing feats of technological prowess. Have you ever seen anything like it? He looks so sad. Sad? When you're that strong, what's there to be sad about? you with a beloved spouse? Well, it's time to take back control from the men of metal. With possession, you are the master. You will bend any machine to your... Sorry, pal. The raffle is all sold out. Want to get into the lottery, handsome? Give that mechanical moral. Right, are you gentlemen who will take arms against the... Right in the skyline, so it was originated by having Young sir, young miss, no we'll turn the clock around again. See them villains zipping around, spreading their lies and dissent? Fear not! I got just the gear. Grab a shotgun and go to work. You there. You got what it takes to keep our city safe? Mighty fine prize if you can keep those skylines clear. Hot dogs, Alexander Hot Dogs, Columbia's finest. We're never seen. First mechanical, him never tired. Red Hot Hot Dogs, Columbia's out. Record a ditty, recite poetry for your little lady, and play it at the box. Please accept our greatest apologies. The raffle is at capacity. Give me one of those. With just a whisper, they're all ears. Tails, 
Come on, let me through. Heads? Or tails? Huh. Tails. Told you. Hmm. I never find that as satisfying as I'd imagined. Chin up. There's always next time. I suppose there is. got them. If we're gonna flush the box out of the Skyline system, we gotta have the best. Uh, we got any openings in the group? Never a charge for the raffle. You've been sleeping under a rock? 77. 77. That's a lucky number. I'll be rooting for you. Bring me the bowl! Is that not the prettiest young white girl in all of Columbia? <laughs> all right then. The winner is number 77! Well, what do you know? Number 77, come and claim your prize! First throw! First throw, first throw! Please, please don't do this. It was me, it was all me, please, please! No. Please, what are you doing? Come on, are you gonna throw it? Or are you taking your coffee black these days? <laughs> Oh, looks like we've got a shy one here. <laughs> Wait, <laughs> it's him. <laughs> now, where'd you get that brand, boy? <laughs> Don't you know that makes you the backstabbing snake in the grass, false shepherd? The false shepherd. And we ain't letting no false shepherd into our flock. <laughs> Show him what we got planned, boys. <laughs> Shepherds have to lead our land astray! Come on now! Come on! Move it! Disconnect! 
the gate! Getting hot. What's going on?
<laughs> that wasn't no sample. Surprising. Surprising that it worked? Surprising that it didn't kill him. But a magnetic repulsive field around one's body can come in handy. If it doesn't kill you. A fair point.
father, Comstock, called on me today to write his biograph. Me. The man pays for exactly 100 pages in advance. Now, I'm half a Jew when I smell silver, so I say, I say, father, your flock would pay for a thousand. You know, why settle for less? And then the prophet looks to me and says, 100 will suffice, as I know how it ends. Blood on the streets, and worse is the insult, because today is the day that marks our secession from the Sodom write his biograph. Me. The man pays for exactly... No! <laughs> Damn hook must be magnetized. Silver. So I say, I say, Father, your flock would pay for a thousand. You know, why settle for less? And then the prophet looks to me and says, one hundred will suffice as I know how it ends.
much blood you got, you boy! Violence is not a foregone conclusion. Ah! Oh! Tim, the one they're after. Go. They're looking for you. Police! We're in need of your assistance! They're here! Shh! Keep your voice down. Move on. Scalps asked about the white ones there. I said, well, sir, if your quarry dwells in the jungle and beds down with the local color, why split hairs? <laughs> Not a chuckle out of him. 
Either he ain't seen a man go native, or maybe, maybe too many. Anyhow, now he's got me hunting down this Daisy Fitzroy. Hope he don't expect me to stuff and mount her. <laughs>
what exactly was the great emancipator emancipating the Negro from? From his daily bread, from the nobility of honest work, from wealthy patrons who sponsored them from cradle to grave, from clothing.
What's this? Some new kind of vigor? That's a hell of a thing. Press to summon murderous crows. Hold and release to create a nest trap. station. to me. Yes, like that. I will kill you!
Columbia. Why do we worship three symbols in your memory? We worship the sword, so that we might avenge you. We worship the raven, so that we might cover the city with eyes. We worship the coffin, because it symbolizes the weight of our faith. that Monument Island is off limits. You've got to go. Workmen should proceed to the island by means of the skyline. The skylines, huh? Those things them coppers came riding in on back by the water. That line heads to Monument Island with a shot. the wickedness of man was great, and he repented he had made man on the earth. Rain! Forty days and forty nights of the stuff, and he left not a thing that walked alive. You see, my friends, even God is entitled to a do-over. And what is Columbia if not another ark for another time? Skyline up above. Somehow I get some elevation, I could probably reach it.
the Delaware a flaming sword and the wings of angels. God bless you. Skyline to Monument Island. I know why you've come, false shepherd. I see every sin that blackens your soul. Wounded knee, the Pinkertons, the drink, the gambler, and of course, Anna. And now, to repay a debt, Dad. you've come from my land. But not all debts can be repaid, Booker. You don't know me, pal. Prophecy is my business, Mr. DeWitt. As blood is yours. You know why these men will die for me? Because I've seen their future in the glory. And hence they are what brought you to Columbia, Booker? Booker? Bring us the girl and wipe away the debt? This will end in blood, Wit. Then again, it always does with you, doesn't it? It always ends in blood, You've come to lead my lamb astray, but thy crook is bent and thy path is twisted. twisted. Go back to the Sodom from which you came! place.
I guess even in a restricted area, these crackers need someone to clean the floors. <laughs> Those politicians and scientists don't bother about what they say around me because I'm some half-leaded colored boy. But I can tell they scared out of their wits by that thing they got locked upstairs. Yes, sir. They got a tiger by the tail, and they don't know whether to hang on or run. Mr. Thompson, sir, I, I replaced the entire fuse banker's ass, and the lights were all in working order last night. Last night? There they go again. We go through boxes of fuses every day as of late, and they're just in the siphon alone. I don't... Oh! oh something's happening! What? Oh, ah! It is one thing to imagine one's future, and another to see it. I have seen the seeds of fire that will prepare the Sodom below for the coming of the Lord. What the but hell Elizabeth, are they doing to her? I will fall before the job is done. But she shall take up my mantle. The Lord is calling me home. I feel his love in every tumor. Because they are the train which takes me to his station. And I go with joy, knowing that Elizabeth will take my earthly place. But the false shepherd is coming to lead my lamb astray. I will not board that train until she is safe from his deceptions.
dressing room. That's where we need to go. job at hand. This job's getting worse all the time. I can do this. My name is DeWitt. I'm a friend. I come to get you out get of here. Get away! Are you real? I'm real enough. He's coming. You, you've got to go. Why? You don't want to be here when he gets here. Just a minute, I'm getting dressed. I can get you out of here. There's no way out. Trust me, I've looked. Stop it, you're, you're too impatient. That's enough. What about this? What about it? This is the way out, isn't it? What are you... Give it to me. It's his 
We'll see about that. This tower. Not going that way. We have to keep moving. He's tearing the building apart. This way! Be careful, Elizabeth! How do you know my name? Not now! Let me try. Which way? Up! What do you want with her? Open this door right now! Are you going to hurt her? Tell me what you want! Anna? Anna? me, Elizabeth. Are you all right? 
Where am I? Back in the land of the living. Here, let me. I'll be fine. You almost drowned. You need to... I said I'm fine. Just... Just, just give me a minute. Do you hear that? Oh, it's music. Yeah, go on, I just... Oh. See that. Okay, I, I won't be long. I won't be long, Mr. DeWitt. Where is she? 